as we delve deeper into the prequels, we find ourselves surrendering to the uncomfortable reality that our actions, like Anakin's, are often dictated by a complex interplay of emotions and motivations, vulnerability, desperation for acceptance, and a desire for power are just a few of the vulnerabilities that can be exploited, leaving us susceptible to the influence of those who seek to control us. The character of Palpatine stands as a chilling exemplar of the destructive power of seduction. His mastery of manipulation serves as a stark reminder that even the most charismatic among us can be deceived by a cleverly crafted illusion. And it's precisely this illusion that Palpatine uses to break down Anakin's defenses, exploiting his insecurities and turning him against the very person he once called friend. This dynamic speaks to a fundamental aspect of the human condition, one that prequels confront with unflinching honesty. We are forced to confront the darkness that lurks within us, the parts of ourselves that we'd rather ignore or deny. Anakin's internal struggle is a reflection of this universal human experience, a struggle to reconcile our contradictions and find a sense of purpose in a chaotic universe. Prequels also remind us that our choices have consequences, that the actions we take today can have far-reaching effects on the world around us. The downfall of the Jedi Order serves as a poignant reminder of this, a cautionary tale of the dangers of complacency and the importance of staying vigilant in the face of adversity. And yet, even in the face of such darkness, the prequels offer a message of hope, Anakin's redemption serves as a powerful reminder that it's never too late to change, that even in the darkest of times, there's always a chance for forgiveness and renewal. This is a message that resonates deeply with us, a reminder that our choices are not predetermined, but rather the result of our own free will. The Star Wars saga is more than just a collection of science fiction stories, it's a reflection of our own hopes and fears a mirror held up to the human experience. It's a reminder that we're not alone in our struggles, that our collective experiences are threaded together in a tapestry of hope and renewal. And it's this message that continues to resonate with us, a message that speaks directly to our deepest concerns and desires.